Good morning, fishers. Day two of our adventure to Kebe. We've driven down to uh, Silver Bay again for an early morning cob session. We've got some baits in the water. Uh, hopefully, it's going to look uh, good. The sea does look good. I'm not going to turn around too much now. The sea looks brilliant behind us. The water color's there. I've got a little mullet uh, strapped fast here. We're going to send him out now as a live bait. Let's hope we get onto some fish here for you guys. We'll see you all later. Morning fish show. So we just arrived at uh, what we think is Silver Bay. Keegan with his first throw, a nice little cob, probably just under size. Uh, we'll pop him. Morning chaps, also it's got a mullet on you now. So we'll see if we can pick up a little bit of a bigger size cob than we did yesterday. Um, it's still early morning, it's a nice outing out here, the weather looks good, the pressure's right, so let's see what happens. Like the chaps. Now bait on there, love mullet on the Evo. Big March is sitting with a nice big octopus. Hopefully to get something bigger than the cob we got yesterday, looking for the 10, 10 plus kilos. So. Yeah, not working as, as well this section of the beach than yesterday, but we'll see how it goes. Probably got a nice little cob on yeah. One light tackle there, so I don't know size wise. Um, or some squid, so let's just have a look what comes out here. Hey man, I was sitting in the bricks, I could feel it on the line. 
Tough lines though, so let's we'll obviously try to get another one. Lekker. I'm in the bricks now. Tom, you got hurt there, back. I, I can feel it. I can feel it shaking on a rock, though. Guys, be very careful. The other rod, the other rod too, back. Hit that rod, Andrew, hit things here this on the uh, live mullet we've got absolutely smashed it as well it's been a lot of action on this side a lot of head shakes this one's pumping so we hopefully uh, can land this one looks like a better sized fish
Right. Well, it's going to rain as well. It's getting a bit exciting out there, Lacka. I'm driving here in someone's line here. Ah, uh, rocks, bricks. Keith, come hold this till it's on, it's on, I think it's on follow mode for Andrew, so I, I click it and hold it. No, no, just hold it like that, just hold it like that. Sure. You got it. Yeah, follow it, just walk slowly, walk slowly. There you go. Got it. Yeah, I wish I could wipe this camera, but it's all good. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. We've got Andrea onto a cracker of something. Proper, proper. Urging this thing. Hey, okay. okay. someone's getting hurt. Hey, someone's getting broken yet. Yeah. Sure, that reel is screaming. Yeah. Screaming. <laughs> Slam and uh, Sierra's getting it's a bit of a workout here. Punishing her. Yeah, boy! Yes, boy! Yeah, boy. Punish her, man. Bring it. Yeah. Henry decided it's uh, time to get this in. Oh, too much. I'm gonna move a bit more. That was uh, so much fun. Uh, just yeah, remember one thing, one. guys. I got a big one. Just remember one thing when. Uh, <laughs>
Just remember one thing when handling sharks, guys, is that you need to try and handle them in the water. It's very, very important. But this little sweetie gave me a very big fight. Tons of fun, especially on an 11 foot rod. Thankfully, I do have the Sierra, which can handle pretty much anything. This is a male sweet William. So we're gonna get it back in the water, guys, and hopefully we can uh, get some more footage. Another target species here at Tebe. Got a little silver out using a ghost crab. Um, just here at Silver Bay. Gave me a little bit of a go. Nice and strong fight. Um, happy to take it off the list. Gonna get another one. Let's see. Cheers, chaps. Just doesn't want to come in there. I want to grab the line. Look how big it looks in here, bro. It looks like a big, like a big one, eh? Crank him over this list now, Don. Crank him. Yo, he tried for you, eh? Yo. Hey, fishers. So, we're down for our evening session. It's been extremely quiet so far, and no action to not much action at all dean's just got a small little gray shark we didn't get a video of that i've just landed this cob uh fishing with a uh, squid head as you guys know one of my favorite baits uh, i reckon this one's between 65 and 70 centimeters uh, yeah good little fish smashed me absolutely uh just smoked me basically so yeah we're gonna get this guy back in the water chat soon yeah. quick little measurement of the cob guys total length from tail to the end of the nose, 65 centimeters. Nice fat little uh, boy or girl. We're gonna go pop him back in the water quickly. Been out the water for a couple of seconds, and so let's pop him back again. Evening for shows, so even when we're deep in the trans sky, sitting in Tebe, we still uh, put some time across uh, to su support the box. Hope to have a good game. All the best, guys. 
Needs some time. Yep. Yeah, there's now. Right, excellent. Okay, we must have two phases ago. We five minutes from their line under the pole. Beautiful the opportunity for us to Island. attack. No, it's the box shot. Nice. Yep. Evening, guys. So, day number two of the planned four day trip to Febe has uh, come to an end. I'm trying to count the number of cod that came out today. I think three, four, if I'm not mistaken. We'll have to, I'll have to go back and watch the video. You guys can do that as well. Uh, a lot of nodheads came out, guys. Uh, some duckbill rays, smooth hounds, sharp tooth hound sharks. All in all, a very, very successful day. Nice day of fishing, beautiful weather. The front has pulled in now, so we might be making a call in the morning and seeing what the weather's doing, decide what we're doing uh, for the rest of the weekend. But anyway, let's get back to the rugby and uh, hope our boys do us proud. Cheers.